from a balcony at a Valley apartment complex. And what's worse, neighbors say the owner is up and left. So what happens now? When you ask, we investigate. Here's Contact 13 investigative reporter Stephanie Zeppelin. An unanswered call from up on a second floor balcony. Neighbors told us about this dog who they said was left behind when his owners left the apartment complex. She didn't take the dog out. Still there. I don't know if he ate or not. Mercedes Lunas lives right across from the apartment where the dog's owners were living. She's not sure when they left, but said she could hear fighting coming from the apartment not too long ago. We went to investigate and saw the door has two papers still taped up outside. One is from management, dated September 20th, saying they would be there for an annual inspection on the 22nd. The second is from animal control, dated September 23rd. Just like a couple of days ago, I saw that the dog was, uh, you know, barking and constantly, and I'm like, okay, because I thought, the, you know, the owners are at work or stuff like that. This neighbor did not know the owners were gone until we told him, and he's shocked they would leave their pet. You can't be abandoning animals, especially man's best friend. If I could give that dog a home, I would most gladly be able to do it. We called management at the Eastgate Apartments. They said they gave the tenants an eviction notice on the 17th for not paying rent. But when they came to do that routine inspection on the 22nd, they found the dog. Management said when they called animal control, they were limited in what they could do because they're in the process of an eviction. Many in the complex are upset seeing him left alone. If that dog dies, I mean, you don't have a heart. You don't have any feelings. It's man's best friend. You don't do that. Neighbors said they've tried throwing food up to the dog, and workers at the apartment complex are bringing him food and water until animal control can take action. <laughs> Stephanie Zeppelin, 13 Action News. And as always, if you have a problem or an issue you want us to check out, send an email to 13investigates at ktnv.com. And please be sure to include your phone number. A dramatic picture just